Hello and welcome back to Shadow of Mordor Part 6, and in this episode, we are doing yet another Ratbag mission. Ew! Don't put blood on the camera. Sure, after all, you're here, and you still have arms. It's like he knows that he has protection. We better hurry or he loses his head. Awfully tempting, isn't it? Because the plot demands it, we need this one very particular character. Although friendship has a really important theme in the Lord in the Lord of the Rings universe. Now, unfortunately, I screwed up the bonus objective here by just going for the elf shot kills on these instead of, you know, uh, sl uh, slowly doing stealth kills on them. I suppose it is wiser to... Wait, we have four... Okay, we have four minutes. We have a total of four fucking minutes to save this guy. I think he's going to be just fine. <laughs> now, if we had one minute to do this, that would be something else. Drog the twin. Talks like you, and I will show everyone here how low that is. All right. Let's go talk our to Our first mini boss, or rather, our first, our first captain fight. Okay, so I don't. You'll okay. notice that you'll notice that uh, that Brog actually happens to have us uh, a special weapon. His weapon is coated in poison, and if you get and if you get hit with the poison debuff, you're no longer able to. Uh, well, you're no longer able to see the uh, the uh, counterattack indicator. You can still successfully do counterattacks, but you, it's they're significantly harder. Remember, our mission is not necessarily to kill everyone. We're just trying to talk to him. Well, no, actually. Sure, we're attempting to interrogate him, but we have to but we have to weaken him pretty significantly before we get the opportunity to do it. All right. Well, one combo strength took out half of his health. And there we go. Now we can grab him and attempt to interrogate. You are no match for elven words. Indeed. Uh, Mog, the other twin. Look familiar? <laughs> oh. And we explode. Okay, him. and interrogation is complete. Bullshit, Ratback. You got captured and you needed saving. This is the second time we've set him free. <laughs> Isn't it close to the third? <laughs> what? Come on, he's our friend. Kind of. He makes me laugh. Why? And how does this help me? Uh, a backstabbing bodyguard? I'll take care of one of the war chiefs for you. You can do the other four on your own. <laughs> you need it to train in camp, right? I'll make sure the war chief is in. You're ready for him. <laughs> now, if it wasn't for the horrible difficulty spike that's coming up, we'd actually be ready for uh, we'd actually be ready for him and his buddies right now. Yes, orcs. orcs. Specifically, rat bags, orcs. Yeah, rat bag power increased. Yep, the power of the orcs uh, depends on what kind of rooms that they drop when you kill them. And he dropped the, the howling storm. Howl I can't yeah, howling storm. Which is a damage increase while you're riding a monster and shooting with your bow. Now, the thing is, it's actually a really, really good upgrade to get. The problem with up, uh, the problem with us is, well, to be perfectly honest, we don't actually ever need to use that very often. So, you know, it's plus we don't actually have the ability to ride caragors yet. 
I mean, hell, the only the only real you know insurmountable challenge we've come across so far, given our abilities, is taking out the grogs. Well, the grogs and caragors. Caragors we can take down, but they're very very inefficient to fight. Car uh, grogs we flat out cannot kill right now. I mean, we can try. <laughs> And then we'll just get stomped because we don't have the the specific skill set that we need in order to kill in order to kill Grogs at the moment. I see. I'm attempting to gain some intel here. Intel is very important, but I put a little bit too much stock into it. Everybody knows something. And I screwed it up. I executed the guy that hit Intel. What is a man but a miserable pile of secrets? Apparently an orc that has been made deaded. The Skothbrawler. There are other executes after you gain Intel. I promise. <laughs> well, I want to go. It's pretty good. <laughs> It's not. I, I suppose it's not how it looks. It's the feeling it evokes. Yeah. Elven Elven swiftness actually makes it so that uh, cross, crossing the plains is significantly faster. It, it's why for the speed run of this game, which is I believe the speed run of this game is just under an hour yeah. uh, at least world record at the moment. Um, uh, you get Elven Swiftness and very little else throughout the game. Boink. Got him. Alright, and so I think with that we have successfully finished that hunting mission. Let us accept the challenge at the end. We will have the head of that looks suspiciously like Mog the Twin. Well, it is Mog the other twin. Damn it, Ratbag. We just let you go. Did you have to get captured right away? This guy's Ouch. the Princess Elise of Orcs. <laughs> no, very specifically because he's actually teaching us shit instead of you know just instead of actually you know just getting captured for uh, without without cause. He is attempting to increase increase his rank on his own while he while he's out on the field. Oh yeah, I'll give I'll give Rat back this. He definitely tries. <laughs> He fails, but he definitely tries, so, and that's, and you know what, that's a life lesson. Come on, Ratbag, keep up. <laughs> wow, this it's a there's a pattern. See, you should know this better than anyone. There, you did it. It works. <laughs> People bleed when I stab them. But we'll see how the war chief soldiers do in the face of a true foe. Rattle a cage and bring out the beast. Kill a berserker with a ledge kill. This is where I get to show off how Attract works, and it's very barely. Attract, uh, as, a, as a skill for the Ranger, is actually okay. Um, unfortunately, Glare. You know, that's a thing. <laughs> unfortunately, that was not a Berserker. Where is the Berserker? I am kind of curious to see what he looks like. The Berserkers like. are marked, thankfully. You, they got the yellow marks on him? Yep. But that's not a true Berserker, though. He's got armor on. Uh, and he has... Well, well, the whole reason that they're uh, verified as Berserkers is because they um, have, a, have a particular passive ability and double axes. That passive ability makes it so that um, unless you uh, stun them or do stealth kills on them, they are very difficult to combo down. Which is weird, because the original definition of Berserker is a soldier who fights with, well, basically naked. 
That dude, that dude is not naked. He has lots of protection. There you go. There, we got him. Explode the platform. There. Alright, Mog, come come on down. Stupid hair. Now, you'll notice that his sword is actually on fire. That just means it does more damage, and I think it can give you the burning status element, which does DOT. Damn it! That is not an enemy. Backstab. Deal with the archer. Always take out the buddies first, not your target. That is how you eventually kill the target. Kill the berserker. Rate's done. Auto combo. Execute. Loop until dead. It's okay. It's it's dominant strategy. One soldier of a great army. No, you are now a dead mog. Oh, quick time event. Each of the war chiefs has a quick time event associated with them. It's usually the same one though. Specifically because it's the execution quick time. You have to so you have to complete the quick time event in order to kill them. Yep. <laughs> Ratbag, you have a knife. You can behead him and take his ear. Come on. You don't need to ki you don't need to kick him. Get the ear. Ranger, we did it. <laughs> now honor our arrangement. Oh, don't you worry. War Chief Ratbag will make sure nobody gets in the way of your dirty scheme. He's lying to us, but that's okay. Ratbag can't speak for the other war. The fine you. print. Could I borrow your... Oh, this blade's dull. <laughs> and that is the end of the Ratbag missions. Ratbag teaches us how the Nemesis system works, and then we can't, and then we can't realistically actually use it for half the game because we're still missing a particular skill that we don't get until we go to the next area. So, I mean, are we not going to see Ratbag? No, we will see Ratbag one more time, and then he will be a dead person. Oh. Yes, it is very sad. And in the next part, we will start doing, I believe, the Hergon quests. Mm. Yep, we're doing the Hergon quests next.